Hey guys, I'm back. Got my coffee. It's Gigi from Gigi's Wig Wall. All right, because I'm not sure how I'm going to post these. So I got to introduce um I got to introduce them each time. So anyway, stay tuned to the end of this um short clip that I'm doing um cuz I have a, a dupe to show you that I think you'll like. I know I'm enjoying it a lot. And so all these things really basically there's thing there are things I like and I'm going to share with you. So, okay, the next part, you see everything's all dried down. I'm ready for to put my foundation on and let me introduce my foundation. So my foundation that I use is Lancome's Tint Tint Idol Idol, I'm not sure, Idol Ultra Wear. It's the Care and Glow which that's what I like is the Care and Glow. The matte finish, I just feel like is too matte for me. Uh, makes me, I think, look older. And so this is what I use. And my color is 305N. That's what I get it in. And I just have this on uh, auto replenish and it comes to me. I think it's about every two months I get a new one in. But I use this every single day. So a nice one. It's an all-day hold. Uh, I never have to worry about, well, my foundation is going to melt into my face or any of that. It just, it holds all day. It keeps a nice glow about it. I really enjoy it. I've been wearing it for years. Uh, if you don't know, um, and I'm, maybe I'm speaking out of turn, but I think Lancome is like the little sister to Chanel. I used to wear a great Chanel one, but it was very hard to get a hold of and it just became a pain. So I had a local uh, store here which had uh, Lancome and now per them, Lancome is the little sister to Chanel. I don't know if I'm being fed a line, but I bought into it anyway. So, love my coffee. You know what I love about my coffee at this time of the year is instead of putting creamer in it, I put eggnog in it. Love it. Drink all the eggnog you can. It's limited. It'll go away and you won't see it for another year. So drink your eggnog. All right. So I put it on my little makeup brush. This is a Sephora foundation uh, makeup brush. And then I apply. I don't have any special way I do this. So I am not a makeup artist. I am a woman who loves makeup. That's what I am. So, I'll just show you how I put it on, which most of us, that's what we are. We're just women that love makeup. And, you know, like my mom, my grandma would say, I love makeup. But she would say, well, even an old barn looks better with a coat of paint. So, I'm just painting on, on this old barn a little coat of paint. This old barn of 32. At least that's what I tell my husband. And I'm 32 again and again and again. So, good coverage all the way around. I get down into the little crevices. I love this makeup brush. It's nice and sturdy. It's thick. It's, it's firm, which is what you need when you're doing makeup. You don't need something flimsy. You can put your makeup on your liquid foundation with other things. A lot of people uh, use these eggs. I'm just not the best with them. I've not gotten them down to um, really knowing how to use them well. I watched this one girl, Bailey Saren, which she tells you Murder Mystery Monday. I don't know if y'all watch that on YouTube. It's a lot of fun. And so she always tells you these horrifying stories while she puts her makeup on, which which I love watching her do her makeup. I think she is a makeup artist. Maybe she isn't, but man, she does some wild uh, makeup and it ends up you think oh that's gonna look horrid you know when she throws on some bright blue like right across her eye you're like oh oh my how's that and it, in the end it just she makes it look so good but anyway I digress so I have my people I like to get ready with so I know how fun it can be so let's just make this fun all right so I think I have it pretty good all over. I always like to get around my nostrils real good. And my lips. I don't spend a lot of time beating it into my eyes because even though I just did, 
but because you're gonna do you're gonna do like um, a primer on your eyelids then you're gonna do a concealer underneath your eyes so my eyes are gonna get treated so I think I'm pretty good well covered does it look covered to you all right so now this is a I use a drugstore powder it's a staying it's it's my setting powder, I would say. I set this with this, and then I'll set it again with it um, when I'm finished. And this is Revolution Translucent Baking Powder. I love it. Now, sometimes I'll just put it on and let it sit and bake, you know, maybe put an extra amount and let it just sit, uh, which I may do that here. I may show y'all, I may do that so you can see how I do it. And I, I bake it in certain areas. Um, you don't have to do that. You can quickly get it done. Uh, but sometimes I like to make them bake. I do. Because I want like maybe a heavy. Like if I'm going out like to a party. Maybe I won't because I'm not going to a party. I'm going to Target later. So, um, but if I'm going to a party or something. I'll throw it on and let it bake a little bit. So, I've got a really good coverage. These little puffs, love them. You can get these on Amazon. I'll link them below. By the way, I shout out to a couple of people I want to shout out to. I've got a social media director, as I call her, and she is great. Her name's Hannah. I won't give her last name, but a shout out to Hannah for helping me with all this. Um, I can make content all day. What y'all don't realize, if you don't do these videos, if you do do these videos, you know what I'm talking about. I mean, you do the video, and, and that takes time setting it up, knowing that you're doing the right thing. You've got everything lined up as it should be. So, I can do that. I can get it all set up and do the video. But after you do the video, there's like two hours more work, work two hours worth of work, more work, uh, did I get that out? Am I struggling with my tongue this morning? Anyway, so there's two more hours of work, um, at least to get your stuff edited, to get it uh, uploaded. I mean, you just don't throw these together and they're done. Like, oh, I'm just going to sit down and I'm just going to video this and no problem. Oh, and boop, it's up online. Nope, that's not how it works. So she is saving me so much time. It allows me to make more content for you guys and feel free to. Uh, there's just something about having to do all that two more hours worth of work that when that's taken off your plate, you can just go and make more content. So thank you, Hannah. She's great, and I appreciate what she's doing for me. Okay. All right, so I'm pretty well set. You see that? I'm going to set it pretty good up here in my eyebrows because I'm going to do my eyebrows next, okay? All right. All right, there's my foundation. 